We're back at Marseille here in Pukekohe, and once again, I've got the Dutch master, Marco Toysha, with us. On this particular episode, we're going to look at the stance, how you position your feet, firstly from the break, and then as you move your way around the table to play different shots. Well, Marco, let's talk about the stance, where you place your feet, where you distribute your weight, and let's start with the break. Yep. First thing you do is like getting your tip real close to the cue ball. Um, then you hold your hand in the position where you want it. So roughly, in, I would say in the middle, depends how tall you are, of course. Um, I roll it like roughly here. So what you want is like putting your right leg under your hand. So when you draw a line, you want to have hit your toes. So that goes like straight in one line under your feet. And this one is for the balance. And this one is going like this direction, but it all depends on the length and how tall you are, of course. So just when I start, it's like one, two, three, and then it's like pretty much like dropping straight down. So this, I have this hand already in a straight line. So when I'm like lined up here, it's like pretty much like dropping down like that. So it's like one, two, three, and I'm in the right position. Well, that was an, a, a pretty impressive break, but I guess as you move around the table, how, how varied does your stance become? Um, it's quite, it's quite straightforward. When you come, like the break is like pretty much the same as when you play any other shot. I mean, you put your cue close to the cue ball and you line up the same way. So when you do it more often, you get more used to it and you know pretty much like where you have to put your legs to line up for the next shot. So what you're saying is that the same foot placement that you use for the break, yeah. you should still mirror and mimic yeah. for pretty much every other shot around yeah, the table. that's correct, exactly, yeah. So it's every okay. shot is the same thing. Okay, so look, I think what we'll do is we'll just take the cue ball here. Yep. We'll just put it here. Yep. Really simple shot. Yep. We've seen the foot placement for the break, yep. but we'll just reinforce it yep. around the rest of the table so, to show that it doesn't change. Yep. So the same thing with this, I get my hand, I put it in a straight line with my arm, with the cue, one in a straight line. So when I line up, so it's like one, two, but this one is already in a straight line. So I actually only have to put my, cue, my head uh, in a straight line of the queue and it's already in one straight line so you're dropping straight down so it's like one two three this one goes to the direction where you're going to shoot to and it's pretty much like putting my chin on the queue and my hand forward and then you're in the right position So there you go, there is a technical component to the way you stand, the way you hold your poise, that distribution of weight. Like anything, it's just a simple case of practice.